few short minutes. A golf instructor from Baton Rouge is facing serious charges in Acadiana concerning one of his students. Tonight, 65-year-old Paul Hensley is charged with online solicitation and indecent behavior with a juvenile. According to state police, he arranged to meet up with a boy outside of instruction time, and that's when troopers moved in. Our Chris Welty finds out troopers believe there are more victims, and Hensley could face additional charges. State police wouldn't say how old the boy is, except he's under 16. He's safe thanks to his guardian, who became concerned after reading text messages from his golf instructor, Paul Hensley. At the time, the conversations weren't sexual, but the guardian called state police. We were able to actually obtain the device that the boy had been using. We assumed his identity and continued the conversations that Hensley had initiated. Hensley is a known golf instructor in the Baton Rouge and St. Mary Parish areas. Troopers say conversations became sexually explicit and Hensley arranged to meet somewhere in St. Mary Parish. This is something that is uncomprehensible. You can't imagine that an adult would do this to a young child. When he arrived Wednesday, troopers moved in quickly and arrested him. Child predators are master manipulators. They are very good at manipulating people into thinking that they are okay. You know, they put themselves in a position of trust. Troopers believe there could be more victims who haven't come forward. If you were a victim, it's okay. We're here for you. We're here to help you. We're going to make things all right. Troopers encourage victims of sexual predators to come forward. They have 30 years from their 18th birthday to report the crime. In Lafayette, Chris Walty, KTC TV3. And this case was part of Operation Child Watch, and the mission is to rescue children from child predators. State police offer classes to train parents and guardians on the warning signs of sexual predators and how to recognize the signs in conversations. If you're interested in those classes, call State Police Troop I. A Lafayette man facing several charges, including first-degree murder and the death of his girlfriend's three-year-old son, will be tried on rape charges.